And we are back. Sorry about that, guys. Last episode, I had to cut it short due to family intervention or family intervention. Does I? My parents basically interrupted my recording session and were like, "Hey, your cousin needs your key needs his keys. Where are they?" Now we don't actually have to fight them, but I'm gonna fight them anyways. Okay, bring it on. Take this! Ha. Don't forget! Take this! Don't forget! Ha! you like five-hour videos? Well, if you guys, okay, for those on Twitch, you can watch all the, you can watch the archives. I'll keep them highlighted so you guys can watch the full-length versions of the videos that I'm working on for YouTube. Remember, Rex. Are you enjoying? Uh, you mean Xenoblade Chronicles 2? I'm enjoying it more than you enjoy games more when you actually play the game than watch somebody else play it. So it's definitely more of a treat. Battleship is way different from a Monoceros, eh? What is Monoceros? Rex, you saw it, right? Moored at a pier back in Goldmouth. Jin and Co's black boat. Ah, that really impressive one. It runs without being hooked up to a Titan, right? I'm no expert, but yeah, looked like it. Sound awesome! Tora wants to see too! You won't get the chance, unless we see those Torna guys again. Nah, 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 nah. Tora changed mind, no need to see. Master Pond changed mind at Drop Up Hat. Well, the Monoceros was pretty sweet, but this is nothing to scoff at either. For sure. It's full of things I've never seen before. Ah! That's because this vessel is result of latest breakthroughs in our Danian tech. Regular folk never so much as set foot on board. You say breakthroughs in technology, but what you mean is salvage stuff, right? Um, not exclusively. I see lots of homegrown improvements as well. Like this, see? Whatever they've stuffed in here, it's been messed with so much, I can't tell what it was to start with. That control panel, it transmits signal to tighten nerves. By running cables to different parts of Titan from here, can control signal flow much more better. What? That's amazing. And this cable itself have 2.4 times the speed and 12 times the capacity of previous iteration. In other words, hit on whole other level to stuff other countries use. Ah. So if they put this in a smaller Titan vessel, it would work even better. Pinpon, correct. <sighs> They seem to be having fun, but it's all gibberish to me. Poppy, what do you think? What should Poppy say? Why, Master Pon act so proud? Hoo-hoo! Tora, very glad you ask. That because tech used in this Titan battleship is same as what Poppy's muscles and drivetrain use. Poppy is surprised. But, however, though, ones that Poppy use are even more improved than these here. Yet more surprise! Okay, uh, DJ, the voice acting in this game is hit or miss. Characters like Poppy and them got good VAs that can actually make the characters sound like characters and not basically robots. Rex is, uh, uh unique. Are you saying you stole the tech from Mora Day? Come on, Tora. Is that what you call sporting behavior? Tora take calculated risk in service to cause of scientific advancement. As a result, not even our Danian scientists capable of reverse engineer poppy systems. So, no worries there. Upon learning secret of Poppy's birth, Poppy feels sense of unease. Uh, everything fine. Probably. Now, Rex Rex, no time for chit chat. Let's get going. Heart to heart, our DNA technology complete. All right, let's open the door. Rex's VA doesn't fit a 15 year old boy. Eh, kind of, but I'm not judging. 
Not much further to exit. Not so fast, my dear intruders. Letting a terrorist from Torna out of my grasp would make me look very bad indeed. Oh, that emerald core crystal! You must be the Aegis! Much as it pains me to admit it, it seems Borad was right on the money. You know who Pyra is? Are you trying to capture her too, you ratbag? No, no, language. But of course, the most powerful blade in all of history, with the power to rend all rest asunder! Only a fool would know of that power and not seek to claim it. And I am no fool! Therefore, I will claim her as my own. You cannot argue with such logic. Flaw detected in final step of logic. <laughs> Sorry, pal. But you've done all the capturing you're gonna do today. Such impertinence for a dirty terrorist! Let's go, Pyra! Got it! There's okay. no way you Time lot to take are going you to win. Well, we got ourselves a decent science party. Uh, it's worth knowing how to deal with Argo. Or Agro, what the fuck. I dare say you've already noticed it, but there's a driver being attacked by an enemy that'll be marked with a red ring. While we call this, Ar While we call this the Argo uh, marker, the wages on the side are point uh, enemies or enemies show the direction you're being attacked from. Aggro is a measure of an enemy's aggression towards the drivers that they're fighting. More, more, the more ferocious the attack is in the air. Eh. You attack an enemy, the more they'll want to attack you back. Drawing aggro is dangerous for healers, since they have low HP. They'll more than likely be incapacitated, um, incapacitated by attacks. Make sure to keep Nia's aggro low. Drivers who have defense-oriented classes are better equipped to draw aggro and absorb enemy attacks, so right now it's better for Tora to have the most aggro. Drivers uh, with fighting classes are the ones that are dealing the damage on the enemy. That's Rex, so make him the mainstay of your offense. Here's a cheat sheet. Defenders take the hit, healers defend defenders, and attackers hurt the enemy. Well, now that you know about aggro and driver classes, the two things to keep in mind when you're uh, we're giving Dung Hall what for? Bullseye! Sweet! Yeah! Bullseye! Yeah! Yeah! Why not? Bullseye! Let's keep this up and we'll win for sure. Spinning it! Please leave it to Toro or Shadow! Bullseye! Break your fast Break! Now that you got three people in your team, I'll give you a quick primer on ceiling effects of, of blade combos. Have a look at the indicators and the pointing to. These show various ceiling effects that can be applied if you execute stage three blade combo. The final special okay. ceiling effect will be okay. Regardless of the type, ceiling your enemy puts you at a massive advantage. So you should be, you should try to hit home with a stage three blade combo. However, there's one drawback to be aware of. When you hit an enemy with a stage 3 blade combo, they'll acquire resistance to that combo's element. When this happens, the orbs signaling that resistance will appear in the enemy. These are called element orbs. Attack the enemy with the same element as the orb, and you'll do and you'll greatly reduce damage. That means using the same combo route repeatedly does much less damage. Uh, when you use blade combos, you should experiment with different routes. Coward. He's just hiding behind his blade. What? Does common sense elude you? A blade can regenerate from any injury. Whereas if I die, my blade will return to a useless core. 
so it's okay to use them as a living shield. You weasel! Even if he can regenerate, that doesn't mean blades don't feel pain. Ha ha ha! How cute! The flea bag thinks we should care about blades feeling! Ha ha ha! I wonder if you can feel pain! Okay, time to take the you guys. Right, let's go! Which one is you? Stop attack! Yeah! Yeah. Rush down! Anchor shot! Spin. Let us make you shatter! Move down! Yeah! Please leave it to Dora! Gotcha! Let's keep this up and we'll win for sure! Dora will show the jackpot flash! I know! Let us make use of it now! Dora! Dora! Yeah! Yeah! Our emotions are in tune, right? Yeah. 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 Don't be fine! I can turn it around! Stop running around! What did they expect from the heat? Thanks for the support! Fucking shit! Our emotions are in tune, right? This nigga runs around way too damn much. Okay, yeah, no, that hurts. Bullseye! Defense protocol activate. Keep eye on it. Anchor shot! Let's go! Why not? No offense! Fucking two! Good! Let's go! Gotcha! Snap attack! Focusing on Are you Jim? Yeah! Yeah! Sure! For sure! I'm going to! And now he's aggravated, but who is he targeting? Oh, it's not that bullshit. What would you have to do? Gotcha! Oh, he launched the shit out of Oh, I got a rare core. How a mingy flea bag in a bunch of stinking kids. I triumphant return to more Arden with the Aegis. Oh. Hmm. Out like a light. That's what he gets for trying to execute Nia. What? He was trying to take me back to more Arden. Rex, this is a trap. A trap? So they weren't actually going to execute you? No time! No shit. Talk later, Rex Rex. We should escape! Master Pawn is right. Chance of reinforcements very high. Let us make haste. Getting out of town would be a good start.
Okay, uh, weird. I'm in the red, apparently? I don't fucking know. Anyways, uh, blade time. I keep hitting the wrong fucking button. Why am I in the red? And we are back. Sorry about that, guys. On YouTube, we had a bit of a technical difficulty with OBS. I think it's because stuff is going on, like, in Miami, whatever. Because that's where, like, my uh, OBS server is at. So I just went to, like, automate it and all that crap and whatever. So, let's get it. Let's get it, boys. If Nia pulls a level uh, five star out of her ass... Fuck these blades, dude. It's a tank. Wait, production mastery. Skillfully. Merc missions. Open space. Increases damage outdoors. Invasion aura. I think it's only happen. It only happens like because of the because of what I use. I think I'm gonna use the next one on Rex. The next two are gonna be for Rex. So let's see what happens if I skip animation. Of course, it's a fucking dog. It's Goemon. Man, fuck Goemon. Alright, next one. Skip animation. So, absolutely nothing from that. Wouldn't it be hilarious if Rex pulls out a five star when you skip cutscenes? I would have been hella pissed. Uh, let's give her a butterfly blade. Uh, we're actually going to switch your blades out, Rex. Uh, switch you out for, I guess, Goemon. Let's prove our new powers. Actually, nah, nah, nigga, hold up. I'm sure it'll work out great. Well, he cannot be disengaged. Why can't I disengage Dromark? That's kind of dumb, actually. Wait, can I? Hey. So, can I disengage you now, or no? This blade cannot be disengaged. So, I can't disengage blades that... I can't disengage main character blades. Neat. Amazing places in it. Perhaps rest and enjoy view for a bit. Because new game plus only. So 
Oh, okay, I see what's going on. Marine Star Fry. So you can't uh, get rid of Blades unless it's New Game Plus. That's kind of dumb, actually. These flames again! It's her! Oh, that's badass. And with a driver, too, this time. That's Morag, the flame bringer. Morag? Special Inquisitor Morag of Morardane. The most powerful driver in the Empire. And wielder of Bridget, the most powerful blade. So together they're like ultra powerful. It looks like they were waiting for us. Yes, indeed. I did feel like we got away a little too easily. I don't know why I expected Dougal to slow you down at all. It was you, right? You're the one who spread the rumor that I was going to be executed. Just to lure Rex and the others here. You catch on quickly. Yes. You certainly proved useful. However... Rex and Pyra are the real price. <laughs> Not quite. The Emerald Core Crystal is the sign of the Aegis. If that blade is indeed the Aegis, then there's something I must do. What do you mean? The power to sunder all rest itself. I cannot allow that to happen again. Hyra destroyed the world. Don't be so stupid. You mean you didn't know? 500 years ago, during the Aegis War, the Aegis sank three continents to the Cloud Sea's bed. Three titans destroyed. I speak not but historical fact. I'm on to you. You want to use Pyra as some kind of weapon? We're not going to let you do that. That is precisely the kind of scenario that I mean to prevent. And what if we resist? Then I will have to restrain you by force. I'm not against that. In that case, I'll make this nice and clear. You will never take her! Then let's see if you have the strength to back up those words, boy. I really should just. If only I was 500 years younger. All right already. Ah, I All missed. Right. Yeah. Defense yeah. protocol. Yeah. Cut <laughs> oh, that's disgusting. Yeah. Dude. Emotions are in two. Let's go. Anchor shot. Let's win for sure. I like your attitude. Spinning You're Eat it. Yo, that damage though. Hold on. Everyone's getting sight. Power Cut swipe. Happy will protect Mastercard. Yeah. Please leave that to Tora. I like your attitude. Yeah. 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 Why is more like water if her blade is... No, I'm not gonna question it. 
shit. More ass. You don't stand a chance against us. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
hanging in there. Those two! Very strong! I know. At this rate, we'll never... There has to be a way. Some kind of... She's a fireblade. We've got to find... Water. There! Guys, are you ready to run? Hmm? Sure. Then follow me. Ah, there they are. Hyra, can you manage a full-powered blast? Yes! Maybe one or two. That'll do. Take this! Yeah! You're getting predictable, boy. Look who's talking. Puppy, no! Roger, Roger! The water tank. So that's their plan. Can fire burn steel beef? Motherfuckers over here nuking shit. Side note, the payment for that shit's gonna be ridiculous. I feel slighted. How so? They actually held back against me in battle. You think that boy did you not see? He could have struck me with that blow, but he averted his aim. He did have good instincts, too. And I'm gonna help her. I'm not gonna let you stand in her way. The Aegis. If she is traveling with that boy, perhaps it is worth letting them roam free for a while. You mean... We'll cross paths again. And when we do, we shall see. I don't think they're following us. Perhaps we're safe, for now. You're right. We should get some rest. I can't go any further. Ah, oh, Tora is pooped as well. Mm. See you later. Huh? We are grateful for all you've done. We wish you well on your travels. Farewell. I want to reach Elysium. What? I made a promise. I'm taking Pyra to Elysium. It's just... She gave half of her life to save mine. I owe her. Oh, Rex. But half the world seems to be after her. With the 
Titans dying off. Living space is running out. That's gonna start wars. And people need weapons to fight wars. That's why they want her. If I can prove Elysium exists, maybe I can stop the war that's coming. But fighting Morag taught me something. I'm not strong enough. I can't do this alone. Nia, you're a driver. <laughs> I could really he use just, a companion like you. Did he just straight up yank fucking Tora? He's like, this bitch empty, get the fuck out of my way. <laughs> just yank the shit out of Tora. Elysium, do you really believe in that myth, kid? Well, Pyra told me that she was born there. Yet here she is. So it must exist. Right? <laughs> your logic is almost as good as Dougal's. Listen, Rex. I don't know if you're stupid or just too nice for your own good. But what if Pyra's just lying? What if this is all an act and one day she turns round and stabs you in the back? Pyra wouldn't do that. Of course I wouldn't. I don't have a knife. <laughs> so... Serious. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even have a knife. <laughs> An emerald core crystal is the sign of the ages, huh? Sure, why not? This could be interesting. Really? My lady. I kind of want to see this Elysium for myself now. Maybe it really does exist. It does. An endless field of green among the clouds, eh? If the legends are true, even people like me. There it is. I almost thought I lost my key card. I'm sorry. Did I wrap it too tightly? It's fine. I'm fine. See? I can swing it like this and it doesn't even... I knew it. Thanks. I feel much better now. I'm sure that's Nia's poultice doing its job. Thanks. Nia, best girl. Let's get it. Pyra, you hurt too. Are you okay? I'm fine. It's just a scratch. Hey, let me help. I can record about maybe one more episode, then I gotta end the stream. About to say screw Pyra. Uh, about to say, Thank screw Py Rex, Rex and Pyra, put Nina and Smash. No worries. Least I Nina can do. Smash. Nina and Smash would be dope, though. Real talk. There. All done. How's that? Hmm. Looks good. Um, Rex? Look, they're the same. Oh. Uh, this yeah. nigga's staring at her titties. He ain't give a fuck about his wounds. Guess they are. <laughs> Just fuck already. So beautiful. Yeah. It really is. I guess that's probably because you made it, Pyra. Huh? Um, no. What? I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> You're just, um, really good at making fires. That's all. It's what I do. And a hundred men busted a nut in that one scene.
Chapter 2, Altitude.